My question to the Minister of Health. Yesterday, the Minister of Health was asked by journalists whether the government is considering further privatizing our health care system. The minister said that the government is exploring all options. Is this government looking to the private and for-profit sector to take over health care services that are currently publicly delivered? And to reply, the Deputy Premier and Minister of Health. Speaker, thank you for the question and allow me to clarify or to repeat what I said yesterday, which was, in Ontario, you use your OHIP card to access health care services in the province of Ontario, and that will continue. Supplementary question. Thank you. Well, that was hardly a no. Um, speaker, again to the minister. Reliance on private health care providers will plunge our public hospitals and health care systems deeper into crisis. Bill 124 is draining staff from the public system, and private staffing agencies are gouging hospitals. Will the minister allow private health care companies into Ontario, siphoning doctors, nurses, and health care workers out of the public system? To reply, Minister of Health. Thank you, Speaker. To be clear, Ontario has one of the strongest publicly funded health care systems in the world. It is world-renowned, first class, it's second in terms of how much we spend on publicly funded health care. That will continue in the province of Ontario. What I referenced yesterday was innovation. We should not be afraid of innovation. We do it very well Order. in the province of Ontario, and we will continue to work with our partners to make sure that that innovation is encouraged and can continue. Thank you, Speaker. And the final supplementary. So I take that as a yes. Uh, again, to the minister, private corporations have a financial responsibility to generate profit. That's a direct conflict of interest with their responsibility to offer affordable, accessible, and high-quality care, regardless of the patient's ability to pay. Does the minister think patients should have to start paying for care they now receive as of right? To respond, the Minister of Health. No, no, no. OHIP cards are used in the province of Ontario to fund publicly funded health care systems. That will continue under our watch. There has never been a change where we will continue to fund OHIP services through our health care system. What you are worried about unnecessarily is that we would be encouraging innovation. And Order. there are many examples of innovation that are happening in the province today that we want to expand, not the least of which are examples that with Ontario OHN, Ontario uh, Hospital Network, and Sick Kids, and many others, which I'm happy to highlight if the member opposite is not aware of that innovation that is happening in the province of Ontario today. Yeah.